You can double play if you want to. <laughs> oh my god, log off, log off, log off. Oh, oh you got out. No! no! Hey everybody, Texonic here, and welcome back to another episode on the Arzerian server. Now, in the last episode, guys, we had kind of gone around the main area at our base and just cleaned up like the main spots that we're looking too well. And we're going to kind of continue that at the beginning of this episode here. Now, so I'm sure most of you guys have not seen this location before because I actually don't think I've shown it on video. But if you remember a while back, I had a meeting with Gray where we had discussed the, uh, that we wanted to build a creeper farm so that we could get some gunpowder to sell rockets. And so this is the farm that we had built and it's actually been constructed for quite some time now. But we were having issues actually like getting the farm to work. Um, but just recently, I'd kind of came back over here again and for some reason like the farm actually just like started working again like it should um but after probably about roughly 12 hours of afk we got about this much gunpowder uh, and it's pretty consistent throughout all the chests the back ones don't seem to be getting as much um so this obviously isn't the most efficient design um and we are currently actually working on constructing a new uh, farm that will hopefully be a lot more efficient uh, but for now, this farm will definitely be satisfying our needs, especially with uh, the player base not being super active lately. But yeah, so we're just going to start off the episode here by prettying this farm up, and then we're going to go move on to something else once we're done with that. Alright guys, so I have both the walls for the water elevators uh, constructed here. Uh, so what we're going to do now is we're just going to take our water bucket, uh, dump the water into here, and what we're going to need to do is we'll have to place down some uh, kelp, which I have here, in order to make sure that... Uh, all the water blocks are source blocks. Yeah, so then what we need to do here real quick. Here, uh, let me get the andesite back. So we'll place a grass block here. And then we're going to take the kelp. And we're just going to build it all the way up so that every water block becomes a source block. So then this can be used as an elevator. And... Okay, sweet, there we go. Uh, and then we're going to have to do the same on the other side too. All right, so I'm gonna dump one down here, uh, break that, get another source block coming up into here, build this back up, and then we're good to go. All right, so then we need to let's see. Oh, crap. okay, yeah, so yeah, so that, <laughs> this is where we're gonna need more signs. Um, all right, place that in there. It's all good. We'll break the kelp, and this one, um, I think we'll have this be the elevator that goes up. And then the other, uh, so we're gonna need a soul sand for that. So we'll go ahead and we'll place the soul sand down in here. Let me see if I can get, okay, I got the grass block back, sweet. And then we'll place in the soul sand. And then as you can see, here we go. And just like that, we're up at the surface. And then this one, obviously then we'll have the magma block on this side uh, to make the water stream go pull you down. Um, and so once again, we'll block this off, place a couple of signs, uh, get a grass block in here, and then go back through and place the kelp. Uh, awesome. So that's what we wanted to start out with. And by the way, uh, just uh, to let you guys know, this floor right here is going to be torn out. Uh, this will be the main floor level that you come through on. Uh, I just haven't constructed that yet. Um, but yeah, so I'm going to do a bit more work here, uh, and I will get back with you guys once I have a bit more progress done on decorating this area. Alright guys, so I went ahead and got a bit of work done here, as you can see. Uh, it's nothing too fancy right now, but it's definitely better than what it was before. Uh, we got the elevators going all the way up to the top there, um, and we just kind of decorated this area up a bit more. But I think I will do a little bit of building on camera here. Uh, so we're going to try to do the roof of this place real quick, and I think what I want to do for that is I want to kind of try to do a bit of like an arch uh, way going up to the top uh, as it goes more in towards the center. Uh, cause I think, uh, I just think that arches like look really cool. Uh, and I think it'd be a good addition to this build. So let's see. So we, so we're going to see how well, uh, we can manage to do this here. So it looks like this goes out by two. Let's see that one went out by two, right? And then, uh, actually I think what we'll do then is we'll have stairs right here. 
and then we'll have a log going across uh, in between both of those. All right, so let's tear this down real quick, and then uh, let's see. We need to, I think, actually tear this one out, and we'll tear that out. Throw in the stair, and uh, I don't know. <laughs> it's it might be a little bit of a tricky design to go with, um, but we're gonna see if we can make it work. Um, but then I know what I want to do is I think I want to somehow incorporate these smooth stone blocks into the roof. And then I also think that we're going to use the smooth stone blocks to redo this logo right here. Uh, and we'll just move it down and then uh, we'll use these instead of the diorite. Uh, but yeah, so uh, I'm just going to copy these uh, arches over real quick and then we'll see if we can do anything with them. Alright guys, so this is what I came up with for the design here. Um, it's not the greatest. I mean, so I have like the lanterns up here and then I have some of the grindstones just kind of hanging down for some extra detail. So this is like the main area that I kind of want to focus on right now. And I'm kind of thinking, um, potentially doing some sort of like a glass design along the roof. Um, now I'm not exactly sure how I would do that. Um, maybe something like along the lines of, um, uh, going, just kind of like going across it here. I'm going to stack up. This is way too hard to build like this. Um. So like kind of uh, building across like this. Um, I don't think I want to have the entire thing just be solid glass because I think I think that would just be a little bit too boring. Um, but maybe have like small like little increments of it like this uh, just kind of going across. And then we'll kind of have to figure out what blocks we want to use in order to kind of frame this area. Um, so I think, let's see. Um, I'm gonna let me try an outline of stone brick first because I usually kind of like to use that as like an sort of just like an outline block. Actually, I gotta admit that doesn't look too bad. I don't think. I don't, I don't know what your guys' opinions are, but honestly, I think that that actually looks pretty decent. All right, and then yeah, kind of continuing that theme. Um, honestly, I don't think that looks too bad. Uh, I do need to add in something. Uh, behind here so actually I'm gonna try out a couple of different things um, first one I'll just do uh, this block right here that we've been using uh, and then this one on this side I'm gonna try using a stone brick block do we have one of those laying around somewhere we'll try that out and then there we go so let's see which one do I like better um I definitely think I like the stone brick better because it uh, still kind of is acting like the frame. So I definitely think since it looks more like a frame, we're gonna go with that. Um, and then I'm not sure, uh, maybe we actually don't wanna have this going all the way across. Uh, so let me try breaking this um, and we can place, let's see, let me, let me, do we, let me use a slab. Um, we can place a slab there so that way we're not just using the stairs again. Um, that we'll have to replace with wood. All right, there we go. Uh, take that back and yeah, that's not too bad, but I don't, I know I don't want to do a stair. I don't think, although maybe that doesn't look too bad. Um, let me try one more time. I'm going to take this one out put a slab there see which one looks better uh, I think for now actually now that I have uh, the slab up on this side too I think I'm actually gonna go with having uh, the slab on the bottom here um, but you guys can let me know down in the comments if you think that the other design looks better um, and then I can because I can always go back and change it uh, but for now this is what we're gonna go with uh, so we're just gonna copy this design over onto this side real quick and then I'm also just going to finish up this part off camera, probably do a similar design to what we did here. Uh, so I'll get back with you guys once that is finished. Alright guys, so this is a finished product of the Creeper Farm. Uh, I have Tech and Gray with me right now so that they can uh, see it as well. So alright, turn around guys. <laughs> mm. Dang. Nice as bamboo. Yeah, yeah. You see, we've got our got our logo over here, which just happened to barely fit into this wall. Yeah, oh, is that our logo? Yeah, it's our it's our partner's logo. That 
Yeah, it's it's, a, it's a, a very scaled down version of it. Yeah. And then you go up. Uh, this elevator. This is the elevator. Yeah, this one takes you up to the AFK spot. I have a spider. Wait, where's the farm? Pretty chill AFK spot. Yeah, so then you just kind of AFK over here, preferably on this side. It's more directly above the farm, so you get better spawn rates. Um. And then, yeah, then when you want to head back down, then you just go in the one on this side, and it'll take you down back to the main area where you can collect the stuff. <laughs> I want to go see the farm. The farm is like that black thing right above this glass. Yeah. And I, I didn't think it produced this much. I thought it didn't work. Yeah, no. It, after updating to 1.14 and moving the AFK spot more directly above the farm, it started working a lot better. <laughs> That's it. I'm like, you're gonna activate your rockets? <laughs> nope. I mean, there's an ocean below this. So. Oh, 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 hello. Uh, <laughs> did you do <laughs> You didn't there's have anything on spawning. Huh? <laughs> there's a lot of spiders spawning in here. Oh, uh, yeah, I, actually, I saw that. I went into Spectator uh, just to kind of like carpets? look at it. Uh, no, the carpets are still in there, but there were spiders in there. Um, I don't know why they spawned. Then. They must have changed something about it. Sounds pretty good. <laughs> Join us. Partners on three. One, two, three. No. Ah, no! no, 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 no. no. Oh, no. <laughs> you ruined it. You ruined it. You ruined it. How many partners on Okay. Okay. Partners on three. One, two, three. Partners. 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 Well, that was awful. <laughs> so since we all finally had some gunpowder, the three of us then decided to go to the location of the new creeper farm that I mentioned at the beginning of this episode to do some construction. And let's just say that things got a little explosive. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll fix it. It's been approximately seven seconds on this. No! no. <laughs> That's what you get. <laughs> I'm trying to fix it. There's no fixing it. <laughs> just... You know what? Your guys' idea of doing this sucks. <laughs> We don't need to drop it down and we can just do this. No, 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 no. Gray, get out of there. Gray, get out of there. Gray, get out of there. Use an ender pearl. I have an ender pearl. Use an ender pearl. There's an ender pearl. Go grab the ender pearl. Gray. Gray. I'm getting out. There's an ender pearl. I dropped an ender pearl for you. He's he's mining out. Just light it. I'm about to light it right now, Dex. Do it. Do it, do it. I'm up, I'm up. Run, 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 Dude, imagine being so rich you could blow stuff up in survival. Oh my god, I know. I, back when I used to play Minecraft Pocket Edition, I used like this duplication glitch that you could do, where you would like, can, where you'd can, like, you'd have items, you'd kill yourself, and it would like, in like a certain way, double the items, and then, um, and basically I would just duplicate a whole bunch of TNT <laughs> and just blow up the entire map. Dude, ravine below us. That's so lucky. Oh, there is. But it's also lava, so it's not so lucky. Yeah, how is that lucky? Um. Okay, <laughs> 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 can we click this iron real quick? Because we need it for. Fell uh, down. For a beacon. Dude! <laughs> I'm mean, literally right next to the giant lava. <laughs> I know. <laughs> uh, 
that's mine. I didn't die with that. Oh, well, then I gave you an extra fortune. Now you gave me a slip touch. <laughs> Turn the fortune. <laughs> There's a fortune book in there. Um, I think I'm gonna mine up in the lava, so. Watch out. I'm currently flying through a meme, so that's how my life is going. Well, that was anticlimactic. <laughs> oh, shoot. Remember to recycle kids. It's good for the environment. <laughs> Your mom's good for the environment. Oh, no, please don't ban me. Dang it. <laughs> We're getting <even> worse. <laughs> no. Uh, you can get back on. Are <laughs> you <laughs> <He was> spawning? <laughs> I'm screenshotting. That's funny. You like spawned and still just like midair in like a really weird position. I got a screenshot of it. <laughs> just, just come over here and shoot that TNT with a flaming arrow. It's just one piece of TNT. It's not like it's going to do anything. Yes. <laughs> Hole. Ah, I get it. H Holy crap. <laughs> Holy cobblestone. Holy cobblestone. <laughs> I have one piece of TNT left. Oh Yo, bruh. <laughs> well, you know what? I have 32 pieces of TNT left. Let's see how I got that, huh? <laughs> ah! Oh god, no! <laughs> <laughs> ah! <laughs> you jerk! Ah! Oh god, launch that! <laughs> Which, how did you get launched that far? Oh, you get it. Okay. Ah! No! Oh no! <laughs> I did not set you on fire, that wasn't me. <laughs> nope. <laughs> <coughs> <coughs> hey, I don't know how many more TNT is, this is not fair. <laughs> this is very fair. Did there be so many mob spawns in this? Oh yeah, uh, I forgot. Dark caves. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> the TNT off. <laughs> oh, goodbye. Watch, I'm gonna kill this zombie with this TNT. Yeah, fight me, zombie. Ha! Yeah, how do you feel about that? Not very good. <laughs> <laughs> Is on your case. <laughs> the old, the old leap, the old leap B, and punch. <laughs> yes, 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 yes. <laughs> I finally got you. <laughs> Turning with some sand. You'll make it in that hole, don't you? I do, actually. Look, there's free stone. Wow. What, you found stone? Where? <laughs> Wait, who am I rooting for? <laughs> Dude, we can just make a and profit. Oh, there you go. Make it. We should make it into a mini game. <laughs> yeah. 
the no, marketing we'll idea question mark? <laughs> but then people will see it where our arena is, so. Well, not here. We'll do it some. We'll make like an obsidian uh, thing. Oops. We'll make an obsidian arena, and then you can fight with TNT in there. Oh, and then you pay us to. Yeah, you pay TNT. you pay us to. Yeah. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Have a heart. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't do it. <laughs> what happened? Okay. <laughs> no, he's after me. He's after me. <laughs> you can double place if you want to. Oh, no. <laughs> 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 Oh my god, log off, log off, log off. Oh, oh you got out. No! no! Was it over lava? Right Were you over lava? I don't think so. I mean, you only should. Oh! I just saw your name tag go zoom. Yeah, me too. <laughs> okay, I saw him go this way. Yeah, that's what I saw. I thought I, I, thought I went that way. No, 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 not that Yo. Yeah, that's right. I don't uh let's see if i can find it um okay so far i don't see anything oh wait, oh it's down here it's not it's all down here hang on i found it it's safe yeah it all it was like in a hole down here but with the between the same okay let me throw out some useful stuff <laughs> your banner oh, oh there's there's a crap ton of stuff up there too oh, okay that's where the rest of it is oh yep i see it okay I was like, I was thinking. I'm like, I only see it have like one piece of your armor. Um, okay, what can I throw out? Um, here, pick up this. Here, I'll throw it on the sand for now. Just make a couple chests. I don't think I can actually get to the nuclear bomb. Okay, then let me. Toss me my armor first, so I don't die. And food. All right, all your stuff should be in here. Alright. Yeah, I think that's pretty much everything. Alright guys, well that's going to do it for today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. Uh, it's always fun hanging out with Tekken Grey because you never know what's going to happen. Uh, and also, I am really excited for the future of this server, I've got to say, because we have quite a bit planned right now. So I'm really excited to get working on that and to have you guys see what all we have planned. Uh, but yeah, but anyways, guys, that will do it for today. Thank you all for watching, and I will see you all in the next episode. Bye, guys.